Uh oh. Secure the furniture! What's up, my peoples? I'm Go here, the freaking geek himself, and today we will be reviewing the Transformers Cyberverse Warrior Class Prowl. So here we are, and there he is. And first and foremost, as always, we'll take a quick look at the packaging. So right on top here, we have a nice image of Prowl looking all like, hey, you be careful out there. And down here, we have Prowl again with his Jet Blast! His name is Prowl. We have Autobots here on the side. He is a warrior classic, classic Canadian, classic Canadian, classic. On the bottom, we have words and things and barcodes. On the back of the box, we have your obligatory product shots. All you need to know about him is he is a military strategist, and that's basically it for the packaging. And moving right along, here we have a Prowl, the next of our warriors in this Cyberverse line. And he is a police car. Are you shocked? I know I am. But let's get it closer so we can take a look at the details. We do have some, uh, some gunmetal gray right up front here for the front grille. Autobot symbol on the hood. You see the front of the car painted in a nice dark blue with some white in there as well. Uh, the windshields and windows painted in a nice light blue. The light bar done in blue and red. Black wheels. And that's pretty much it as far as the paint goes. There's the top. There's the bottom. Visible head syndrome. Hi, how you doing? It does roll. As rolling things should. Hooray for rolling. And for comparison, uh, here he is with Warrior Class Bumblebee. Here he is with Warrior Class Prime. Here he is with his Wave Mates, Sound Wave. And here he is with the Ultimate Class Optimus Prime. So, there you go. So that is basically it for the vehicle mode. Um, there are no accessories. What you see is what you get. Um, his gimmick doesn't work in uh, in the vehicle mode. It's locked in place, but um, it will work in robot mode, and we'll get to that when we get to that. And let's get to it. So let's get down to transformation, shall we? Let's. So let us raise up a bit. So I have a little bit of room to operate. So what we're going to do is just crack this boy in half. Like so, transformation, as you can guess, is quite simple, quite straight to the point. So just extend the legs, split them, flip out his feet, flip out his feet, and there you have the lower body all done. So now moving on to the upper body, we just bring the arms up, bring them out, bring them down, and then bring them forward, down, forward, and we can just open up. His door wings here, and then we just drop all of this down, like so. Not too far, not too far, not yet. And there you go. There you have a Prowl in his robot mode. And he's a decent Prowl figure. For what it is, I think it's, it's pretty decent. I think it gets the job done. Not too shabby, actually, in my opinion. Anyway, I don't think it's too shabby. So, <laughs> Let's get in close here so we can take a look at that head sculpt. I do quite like the head sculpt. Actually, I think it's a pretty nice looking head sculpt. He's got a total, like, Jay Leno chin going on there, but I think it's pretty cool. And face done in silver, eyes done in blue. Got some red there for the crest. Got the badges there on his shoulders. The forearm's done in that dark blue. You know, obviously you could use a better paint job, but oh no, I do think the design of this figure. There's big old feet and the back. Not too much to talk about. But yeah. Now, articulation-wise, uh, he does have a neck joint. Hooray! He actually has a neck joint, so his head can rotate. So we can actually look from side to side. Hooray! Uh, the shoulders are on a ball joint, so the arms. Can do a full 360 if you move the door wings out of the way. Can move it. Oh, oh, I didn't mean to. Hey, 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 hey. 
That ever happened to you? No. <laughs> so the arms can do a full 360. They can move in and out. Don't push down on his chest, but they can move in and out. So as you can see, you have a ball joint there and also that transformation inch. So the arms can move out and you get a little bit of forward and backward movement. Uh, elbows, you get under, slightly under 90 degrees of bend there at the elbow, nothing at the wrist, nothing at the waist. Hips are on a ball joint. Legs can move forward that far, back that far, outward. You can do the full splits. You also get a bit of rotation up there at the ball joint itself. As far as knees go, you get full range of movement there at the knees due to transformation. And the feet, they can't move up, but again, due to transformation, they can move down if you need them to. And the door wings can be angled however you want. And, of course, he does have his gimmick, which already went off accidentally, so you already saw it, but we're going to do it officially now. So he does have his Jets Blast! And to do that, you just want to push down on his chest, and boom! You get the shoulder cannons there, that pop out. You can see a dead and gray with some blue there on the barrels. That's pretty cool. So that completes the look there. Gives him his shoulder, his shoulder guns. That's pretty cool. That's actually pretty cool. I like that. I think that's pretty fun. So there you have that. And now for comparison, here he is with the Bumblemeister. Here he is with Soundwave. Here he is with Windblade. Here he is with. Warrior Prime. And here he is with Ultimate Prime. So, there you go. So, there you have Prowl. And uh, he's a decent little figure for what he is. You know, he's not completely hindered by his gimmick, which is always a good thing. So, he does have, you know, at least... Basic articulation, neck, shoulders, elbows, uh, you know, hips, knees, even the feet move, even though it's, you know, just downward for transformation, but the feet move, so, you know, he's got more articulation than most of the figures in this line, so, hey, good thing, good thing. I do like the design of him, too, you know, again, it's basic, but I think it works for him, but, yeah, all in all, not too shabby, not too shabby at all, so... There you go. Now, if you would like this or any other Cyberverse toys, you can always check out BigBadToyStore.com for availability. There will be a link in the description down below, so you can check that out. You can also check out the Cyberverse playlist for any reviews you may have missed. Also linked in the description down below, so you can check that out as well. And I think that's it. So don't forget to check out M Games, check out Lori Plan, follow me on Twitter. All of that good stuff down in the description below. And I think that's pretty much all there is to say. So there is the Transformers Cyberverse Warrior Class Prowl. And this is M Go saying, remember, you don't stop playing because you grow old. You grow old because you stop playing. Be a geek. Be proud. Boom in your face. Ah. Oh. Finally back. Jeez, it has been a long, long day, and I am ready to relax and have me a donut. Um, yeah, about that, uh, all the donuts are gone. I'm sorry, what? Yeah, yeah, all the donuts are gone. We, we, we tried to save one for you. We did, but they were just, they were just so good. They were like the best donuts we've ever had. I see. You'll excuse me. Jeez, what was that? Prowl managed to flip every table on the base at the same time. I'm not even mad. That was impressive.